Today on Godly Living Farms, we're going to be unboxing our Brother Computerized Sewing and Quilting Machine. This is model number uh, SQ9185. It looks like this. It has 130 unique built-in sewing stitches, 170 stitch functions. It also has eight different styles of one-step auto size buttonholes. It has the easy bobbin winding system as well as a really super bright LED for the work area. It has a free arm for sewing on cuffs and sleeves where you can take apart the bottom portion of the machine and this slides off this whole piece right here as an extra. It slides off and allows you to do that so that you can easily slide your slide your sleeve on there. It also has a needle position button which allows you to be able to change the position of the needle which is really good for those who do quilting and a lot of really thick um, kind of quilting and sewing. And it also is an automatic without a foot uh, needed type of sewing machine. So we're just going to begin by unboxing it and see what's inside. I purchased this sewing machine from uh, Walmart directly. My last one that I got was from Sam's Club and it cost at Sam's Club it was uh, 200 and today this one that I got was uh, 170 from Walmart. So we begin by taking it out of the box. We'll set the box down here on the floor. It comes in a sealed protective styrofoam. On the back of it, it has your instruction manual and all of your papers for warranty as well as operation guide. So we'll just put that to the side. It comes with a small bag of sewing feet that you will use to change if you're going to be quilting, if you're going to be doing any buttonholes, things like that. has that one. It also does come with a foot so that you can sew the old-fashioned way if you prefer. And it comes with your power cord as well that you can plug in. So I'll just take my scissors here. There's some tape. and run across the top so that we can get this open and on the sides as well turn it around sorry if it's really noisy all right Looking good. One more piece on the bottom. And there we go. We'll just toss those pieces to the side. And here's what the machine will look like. Take all the plastic off so that you can get a good look at it. So again, this is the Brother sewing machine, model number SQ9185. You're going to see that it has buttons here and here to be able to control your back stitch. This is going to be a, a needle threader. This is so that it's a one step needle thread. You push the button, it threads the needle literally like the bobbin part and then comes back up when you push it again and pulls up your bottom thread so that's really helpful and then this one is to start and stop when you are sewing without your foot and then this is your control setting for the speed that you will go and then you have your buttons here these buttons are for the different stitches that you will also note over here this is um, approximately 100 stitches on this part. And then over here, 
because you'll notice you'll have two. One will be the select of the actual stitch. One will be the position, uh, how wide you want the stitch and how long you want the stitch. So that's really good. And then you'll see up here at the top you have your check. And down here you'll see your, your um, delete and add. So that's if you're going to do monogram stitching, which you have that available, your monogram, your mirrored stitching, and your regular stitches. Up here, you'll see a tension wheel. This is just like any other tension wheel on a sewing machine. It will help you to be able to um, judge how tightly you need that line, that thread. And then um, also you'll note that on the top of the sewing machine, you have a guide that helps you to be able to, sorry about my phone, to help you to be able to do bobbins as well as thread your machine. So here we have one more little diagram that helps you to be able to uh, know which one that you want to go under in order to thread. Um, and then of course you know your bobbin. It has the, the little diagram that shows you uh, in steps one, two, and three which way you want to go to wind your bobbin. Um, another really good thing to know with any of the Brothers sewing machines not only do you get a limited warranty but then you can also get an extended warranty and so that's really great. Um, also Brothers sewing or excuse me, Brother Customer Service is always available. They um, have great help when you need, I mean, really, realistically, I, I called and I had an issue with the way that my threading was actually working, um, and they helped me through the steps and actually directed me to a really good book that you can find online that helps with... Um, learning you know basic stitching and things like that so I've been sewing for approximately 20 years or so so um, I didn't really need the book but it was great that they were able to help point me in the direction because if I was somebody that was just learning I would not have known that so um, as far as the bobbin goes you have a quick release now that I've removed that you just um, there's a little button here. You slide it over. This pops up. You can access your bobbin. And over to the side, you have a diagram, again, that shows you how to put your bobbin into place and where to thread it so that that comes up as well. These are interchangeable feet. There's a little lever in the back that collapses the foot. Like, literally, it will um, drop the foot off. You can switch it out very easy. Um, so much easier than what it used to be because uh, with the older machines you had to unscrew it and then remove the foot and it was just a pain and so anyways then you have your um, extender that goes on the end of the sewing machine just as it showed in the pictures um, so thank you for joining us on Godly Living Farms that is the brother sewing machine